My name is Dulce Garcia. I'm a DACA recipient and an immigration attorney. To me, as a child being undocumented, although I didn't understand what it meant, it meant fear for my family. For example, we weren't allowed to play outside very much. We had to be aware at all times that there would be immigration officials. My dad was working as a welder. He injured his arm, shattered it in several places. He didn't go to the ER room. And once he realized that it was getting infected, he went to the doctor and the doctor told him if you had waited any longer, uh, your arm would have had to be amputated. And that's what it meant to be undocumented. And you have to make the decision, is this emergent enough to risk deportation? For example, we see with this Now Me Too movement, some people don't have the ability to say Me Too because they're limited by their immigration status. And a lot of people are still afraid of what could happen if they speak out and say Me Too. I knew I needed to learn immigration law. And I knew that one day I would not have to be an immigration lawyer to understand why 15, 20 years later, we still wouldn't have a way for us to be lawful here in this country. DACA, to me, means endless possibilities. It means the American dream that the only thing limiting us is our, our own work. Although right now we have a temporary order in place, I think we have won so much already. And we have given hope to many people that had lost hope. We wanted to let the administration know we're not afraid, we're here. I think if we allow our next generation to dream freely, that would be better for everyone.